What's up, everybody? <clears throat> Thanks for watching the replay. As you know, my name is Grambo. I will be doing some doodles today for you. And um, there was a little glitch in the system before, so uh, each person from now on uh, has 24 hours to watch the doodle scope before it deletes, because uh, the doodle scopes are deleting automatically. So welcome everybody, thanks for joining. We're gonna do some doodles today. We got some uh, some good lighting. So we'll take some requests and we're gonna do some drawings. So let's start the new page. Start the new page. What's up? Well there, thanks for joining. Thanks for watching. So I'm just gonna do the usual routine. So if you guys, people don't make it out uh, to the doodle scope, and watch it and see how it turns out. You guys can follow me on Instagram. So you could uh, follow me on Instagram. I'm a UPS guy, can you do something about that? Some packages. What's up, Joey? What's up, Bolat? What's up, everybody? Follow me on uh, Instagram, Grambo Doodles. There you go. Or you guys can follow me on Twitter. Do a little Twitter bird. Grambo. All right, so what's the first request here? Let's, let's start some doodles. This is gonna be a short scope today. All scopes last 24 hours. If you guys don't get to watch the replay, you guys can check it out. Follow me on Grambo Doodles on Instagram. All right, let's sharpen up this pencil. Is that like a magic marker? Nope. So this here, if you guys can see that, the light's kind of, there we go, I'm in the shadow. This is a Faber-Castell brush tip pen, so I'm going to use this for some shading today. Got a nice sunny day. This is a Copic Multi-Liner Waterproof Copic Proof Pigment Ink Pen. So that means you can draw on it really well, won't smudge right away, it's waterproof, you can go over it with watercolors, it's pretty pretty good pen, I recommend these. They are, in Canada, about $13. A locomotive, ooh. Uh, that's gonna take me a little while, but I could do, I could do that. Um, what's up, Catherine? Um, this is a 0.7 tip. The tips are replaceable. They last a really long time. You can pull the inks out here. The inks are replaceable, refillable. They're great. What's up, Catherine? All right, I'm sharpening this pencil. So normally I draw in blue. Today I'm gonna draw in purple. We'll see how that looks. We will see how that looks. What's up, Kaya? First day on Periscope. Welcome. All right. Get my eraser handy. My little doggy. No requests. I can't believe all you guys are coming in here. No, no uh, specific request. So I can do some cartoons. I'm really good at cartoons. Disney characters. Aliens. I don't do aliens ever since the encounter. I was uh, I accidentally saw an alien once. I caught it on camera. Um, don't want a, a turkey. What kind of turkey? <laughs> Wayne Bear. A turkey. I guess I could do a, car, a, a cartoon turkey to get warmed up. Why not? A zebra. Okay. We, we, do, we got some animals. No characters, but animals. So, okay, let's do zebra. So, zebras are pretty much horses, so I'm pretty... I can draw horses. Sailor Moon. No Sailor Moons. I tried drawing a Sailor Moon once and it ended up looking like uh, Sailor Venus and everyone got mad. They started throwing tomatoes at me. They all got angry. I was like, what's the difference? And they're like, groan. They're all mad at me. They're so angry. <laughs> I was like, what? United killing the rabbit in lieu of United killing the rabbit. They killed a rabbit? Man, they're on a roll. Let's do a little let's do a little zebra just to get warmed up. I'm just gonna draw like a little head for the zebra. Hey, what's up, Janilo? Janilo. Alright. Let's get the let's get the ears where I want the ears. They all have like mohawks, don't they? So let's put his head like this. And then we'll give him like some personality. We'll figure what this guy's personality is going to be. 
goodness nostrils like this this is the beginning the beginning of the zebra the zebra head try captain america with venom Ooh, captain america all right if you guys are just joining what we do is we take the doodle requests fill this page up when this page is full the doodle session's over i am a hobby doodler on periscope normally i uh, doodle late night there's a lot more bigger crowds in late night. He's been through some stuff. He's so tough. Oh, so he's a tough, he's a tough zebra. He's been chased by a few lions in his day. He's like, he goes, zebra shows up to the watering hole with a cigarette in his mouth. I thought it was around the country, but no. Oh, really? He's like, I've seen some stuff, guys. And the gazelles are looking at him like, what are you talking about? He's like, oh, man. You finished with that? And he grabs the... The shot glass off the bar. There was an angry lion the other day chasing me. I lost him back in the bush. Alright, get the little he's taking on some taking on legions. Lions. What's up, Moo? What's up, Solo? Hand solo. Luke, I am your father. Doing a little quick daytime doodle scope today. Getting the ears right. Getting the ears right, just like that. How old are you? Oh, how are you? How's your hand? The hand is better. No, not as much drawing lately. What's up, Oliver? What's up, everybody? So we're just doing some doodles. So what you do is you kind of get your shapes down first. Figure out where, how I want this guy's body shapes to be. I can put the stripes in after. Stripes take a little bit of time, I think. So this is his head. He's gonna be a little chubby. He's a little chubby, but he somehow managed to outsmart the lion that was chasing him. And then his body, I don't know, maybe we'll just do like the head so I have room for some other doodles. So let's get his mouth right. Let's make it a little bit bigger mouth like this. So it's happy. It's a happy zebra. See, I got this little uh, dog eraser, and he rubs his bum. He wiggles his tail. <laughs> wiggles his tail. And I need to erase something, which is very rare. Which is, I think this eraser is going to last a long time. I think this eraser is going to last a long time. You should do Philbert from Rocco's Modern Life next. Philbert from Rocco's Modern Life. All right, this is going to be his mouth, like this. Give him a little big smile like that. Alright, there's there's the zebra. Have I been awesome nowhere from Nura? Zebra. Any fun plans for the weekend? Everybody's working for the weekend. I'm gonna hopefully get some sunshine. Maybe get a bike ride in. Everybody's working for the weekend. What are you guys up to? Still working? Ah, uh, you're working, delivering packages? Oh, I was walking down the street one day. Uh, just, I think it was on Thursday. Yeah, yesterday. And we were walking by um, this building downtown. And we saw this FedEx guy get out of his truck. And he was trying to get into this door carrying a big package. Oh, you're a tractor trailer driver? Oh, cool. Sounds like a good time to do some bacon. Oh, bacon. What are you baking? And it was funny because he was waiting at this door and then a UPS delivery guy comes up and they meet. And just when you think that wasn't it, a pure later guy showed up at the same time. And they're like, are you guys all going for this address? And they're all like, yep. And they're like, heh, heh, heh. It was like three worlds collide. And they're all like, we're just doing our jobs. It's like, peace, guys. Peace. It's kind of funny seeing all those different uniforms. What's up, Mr. Kafka? Welcome. <laughs> it's just weird to see all these three guys like waiting. They're all they're all cheerful and happy. Happy to see each other. Like, hey, are you trying to get in here too? He's like, oh yeah. All right, so there's a little zebra head. Do you want some big big zebra teeth? Should we give him some like big big teeth? Almond Joy cookies, peanut butter cookies, chocolate chips, and cilantro cupcakes. Cilantro cupcakes? What? Who 
with cilantro and a cupcake? Is this some new sneaky thing that I've never heard of before? Okay, we're, what we're gonna do is we're gonna use this ink pen here. What's up, brown sugar? Brown sugar. What's up? We're doing a zebra for the warm up. Doing a zebra. Oh no, I didn't. Oh no, I didn't. Zebra. Zebra. I'm good. How are you doing? How are you guys doing? Oh no, I didn't. Oh no, I didn't. Let's get his little nose like this. His nice mouth like that. So I'm just going to quickly just do the outlines a little fast here. Pick up pace so we can do some more characters. What was the next character that we we're going to do? I'm getting, going, leaving your dance practice. Oh, cool. Got to practice. Practice? I'm talking about practice? My mom's boyfriend's birthday tomorrow and his favorite thing is cilantro and he loves sweets. Have you ever put them together before? What's up, Purdy Nerdy? She spelled my name wrong. It's like right there in my profile, she spelled my name wrong. Shaking my head right now. Shaking my head. But at least she shared. She made up for it by sharing. Sharing is caring. So if you guys are new here, what we do, you guys can follow me on Grambo Doodles. If you don't make you like, oh, well, thanks for not liking my name. How dare you? Uh, you can follow me on Twitter for Grambo. If you can follow me on Instagram, Grambo Doodles. Uh, and these scopes last 24 hours. There was a glitch in the system and they started saving. And then I ran out of space and now they're slowly starting to delete. So uh, enjoy them while they last. It's, it's good to see you early. Oh, thank you. Spell check might have messed up. Spell check, spell check spells my name wrong. Spell, spell check spells a lot of things wrong. The worst, the, the biggest thing that I hate about spell check on iPhone is whenever I spell the word gave, like you just gave me a high five, it automatically changes it to have. And I'm like, I'm spelling it right. I'm spelling gave is a real word, but it always makes it have. And I'm like, ah, oh, iPhone, you're killing me. You're killing me, iPhone. Yeah, what's up? Like they need to, like they need to, what's the topic? Well, we're, I was hoping to do some Disney cartoons today, but we'll do whatever. We'll do whatever ones. Does anyone, so does that happen to anybody else? The whole gave turning into have? So for Xmas, I made him some slender shortbread and he loved it, so I found cupcakes. Oh, cool. I'm gonna eat some uh, wheat thins right now. Some crackers. I'll put them right here on my uh, desk right here and eat these things. Mm -mm -mm. Salty goodness. Mm-mm-mm. You guys like cilantro too? Oh, it happens to you, the half calf thing, gave thing. No hummus or dip? Hummus? I like hummus. No, now you need chocolate. I'm, I'm gonna make some dinner soon. I'm gonna make some chicken burgers. Chicken burgers. Chicken burgers. All right, let's get this guy's mouth up here. Yeah. Yeah. Let's give him like a nice jawline. Not a cilantro fan. I like cilantro with my Mexican food. Was up, mischievous? Yep, zebra. I like uh, cilantro. I mix it in with my uh, guacamole, homemade guacamole. I don't like it when the iPhone and when it's like something it changes it. Yeah. What's up, everybody? Look at that. I can make my phone glisten. I mean, my uh, pen glisten. Glistening in the sunshine. Well, that was a salty cracker. I'm walking on sunshine. So if you guys are new here, scopes last 24 hours. If you guys don't get a chance to watch the scope, you can follow me on Grambo Doodles on Instagram to catch the uh, the rest of the doodle. You miss guacamole? I love guacamole. It's so tasty. Alright, so I'm just going to get these outlines here. And then I'll just quickly fill them in with a different pen. I'm going to show you how that is done. So I kind of like these lines. Oh, I'm going to put one more stripe here. Why not? A dolphin? You guys want a dolphin? Is there... 
Any Disney dolphin characters? Probably not. Alright, so I like that tooth. Give him a little couple buck teeth. Is there? Which ones? Alright, so I'm just gonna, now what I do, I like to go through with a little thicker one. So this is my 0.7, that was my 0.25. Because we're talking about recipes. Alright. I just see how that's a little bit thicker. A Disney dolphin? This should be. I just like to go over the outlines a little bit. Just the outlines with a little bit thicker of a pen. Or any lines that need to be a little bit thicker. Kind of looks makes it look a little bit better. Sometimes. Unless my line works really accurate. Or it doesn't need it. Just like this. It's so nice and sunny today. I did a lot of planting. I don't know if you guys are into gardens or not, but I love gardens. Reminds me of my mom. And I like plants, it's very relaxing. Then you could show us your selfie draw. You didn't get to see it. You guys didn't get to see the uh, drawings. So these are the last drawings for the past few days. So I can do some characters if you guys think of some characters. So these are some of the characters that we did. Yeah, it's a very bright sunny day today. Look at that. Some portraits of some people that sent me some some photos to draw. I have a snake plant that I planted. It's a little baby. There's me. Haha, <laughs> there's a really funny self-portrait. Yeah, there's another one. The Beast from Beauty and the Beast. And then this little guy. Scary Skull, crazy teeth, and I'll get a tattoo or not. Can you use that? Oh, sweet. Yeah, if you want, if you want me to do like tattoo requests, I uh, I'll do tattoo drawings for free if you uh, follow me and um, message me on Instagram. So the deal to get a tattoo drawing for free um, is you have to get the tattoo and you have to show it to me. That's the deal. A sloth. I did a sloth recently. Did you not see the sloth? I think that was in my other book. Make sure you guys follow me on Instagram. You can see that sloth. You just got two tattoos? No, you didn't. You wouldn't do that. Grambo Doodles. Are you school trained or teach yourself? Uh, both. Yeah, sweet. So yeah, Grambo Doodles right there. G-R-R-A-M-B-O-D-O-O-D-L-E-S. But I highly recommend not getting tattoos because when you're my age, they end up looking really bad because the inks still fade. And what happens is your skin grows and it starts to stretch. Like, look at these wrinkles. Imagine if I got a tattoo here, it would get all soft. And so the thing about tattoos is you end up having to like, I'm aging in tattoos, like awesome. Okay, well, it's always a matter of opinion. <laughs> um, you always have to get your tattoos sharpened up again. But I'm not one to get tattoos because I get bored of things real quick. I could get a tattoo of some doodle make it for you. Get a doodle maker for you, what? All right, what's the next doodle? Need some of these crackers. Mm -mm -mm. One should always do that. Yeah. What did you get tattoos of? Is that why you asked for my selfie? You wanted a tattoo of my face? Cracker lacking. Lacking cracking. Rare lacking crackers. You have a tattoo of my face? Sweet. That's a good idea then. I like tattoos of my face. Or my name. If you get a tattoo of my name, I'll give you five bucks. I hope I'm above Elvis. Or am I on the other cheek? That's pretty funny. Does it say Love Me Tender on it? That's an Elvis song. Does it say Devil in Disguise? How about the mouse from Cinderella? Oh, that's a good idea. I like doing the mice, mice from Cinderella. I 
shadow is great. Oh, I can do shadow puppets. Hey. Hey, what's up? Are you eating something? Oh yeah, I'm eating uh, crackers, these wheat pens. Mmm. Wheat pens. Do you want the lady mouse? Do you want a lady mouse? Do you want a lady mouse? I have a plumeria blossom because of my mom and when we lived in Hawaii. Plumeria is pretty good. Plumeria smells so good. No, do the fat one. We like to call them a little hefty. It's a politically correct term. They're a little large in areas. Oops. Dolphin, my wife is chanting. Dolphin, dolphin. All right, I'll put dolphin on my list. We'll do this mouse, and then we'll do a dolphin. Cinderella. The fluffy one. A fluffy dolphin. You crazy. Can anyone know that? Does anyone know the names? Oh, you know the names. How dare you? You just totally answered that before I even got to ask it. <laughs> oh my gosh. That's okay. That deserves another cracker. This is your reward, and I'll eat it. Mm -mm -mm. The seven little boys from Bianca? You mean dwarves? Queen of Cups, welcome. All right. Um, trying to figure out how to get some room in here. Mm, what's up? But I would love any of them because you are drawing them. Oh, thank you. All right, well, let's try to make this little doodle. I'm trying to get the shadows right here. All right. So we're going to do a mouse, then we're going to do a dolphin. If you guys can see this, okay. So let's see here. How are we gonna draw a mouse? So it's got a big head. Let's give him like a nice big head. What's his head shape? And big ears. Put it here like that. Let's give him a little bit of bangs. Just like this. And he's gonna have a like big round nose. Big, big schnoz. Like this. So that's going to be his face shape. He's got a double chin because he's kind of hefty. He's a little big. These guys are heroes. I'm going to start the ear there instead. Make it a bit bigger ear. Hey, what's up, Nona? What's up, everybody? No more blue. I have to go to the art store this weekend. I ran out of blue. So we're using purple. I'm about to go live, but I want to say hi. Oh, hey, how you doing? Going live? We'll do it live! We'll do it live! What time is it where you guys are in the great wide world? I'm so hungry. 6 p.m.? Wait, it's 6 p.m.? It's 6 p.m. where I am. How can we have the same time? That's weird. The world's a big place. Oh, I just came by to say hello. Okay. Oh, my replays delete. You got 24 hours to watch the replays. Because you're both amazing. I need to bake, but I want to tell you guys. There's the key. Yeah. I'm going to start uh, saving some space and getting rid of all the replays. So that way people can follow me on Instagram. It's my new strategy. Mind you supporting and separating from the crowd. Separated from the crowd. What? You drink alcohol? That's weird. That's so strange. Is that the new Delia Trunk? Yep. 
sleeping after 24 hours. 8 o'clock in Mexico City. Mexico City? This stuff's made in Mexico City. Have you ever tried to doodle any celebrity in a doodle? Yeah. Sarcasm. Sarcasm. Cinderella. Cinderella. Maybe I'll put his hand up here. Make him have a big arm. Once I get a hand right, let's see. There's little fingers like this. Little hand. Uh, your last picture was that kid from Peter Pan? Yes. Oh, thank you. It's six there, but it's still so bright. Oh, it's going to be bright here until 8 o'clock. It stays light out until about 8, and then the sun goes down. Probably be a nice sunset tonight. Cinderella. Cinderella. What do you think about the Illuminati sense in Disney? Illuminati sense? What's that? The NFL. Oh, I might take some of the NFL draft or something else. Shake my head. Not getting the picks you want. Got the NHL draft this weekend, too. Or the lottery draw. All right, so now I kind of, I kind of don't mind how this is looking. I'm going to save myself some room for the other doodles. So I'm going to leave some room. So now I'm gonna just quickly outline him too. Is that shadow causing some major problems? Time to get that cracker. Is that person, oh thank you. Is that person that wanted the uh, dolphin still there? Nah. Is that zebra from the old zebra gun from the 90s? What? A zebra gum? It's like, chew it. Bubble tape. Fruit by the foot. Gum. Gum air. Kirby for the win. All right, let's get these lines here. Big round nose and the gummy. Oh, thank you. Illuminati allegedly controls Dizzy. Illuminati? <clears throat> I thought you were saying like Moriarty, like Sherlock or something. Profile pick is group. Oh, yeah. That's my pick. Profile pick. I am Groot. He's good next to me. Oh, thank you. I am Groot. I am Groot. <laughs> hey, have you posted something new on Instagram? Not yet, I will. I should probably take some pictures tomorrow if it's nice and sunny with my new camera. So I've got a, a new kind of cool camera. Give me a little hair. Do it. Do it, Omri. Do it. Make them like big eyeball. Like that. Well, I gotta go there. Alright, cool, cool. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks for watching. Sunshine, lollipops, and rainbows make me happier. Is this the camera that caught the visitor? No, that was um, a, t a telescope. So yeah, that was the day that I had bought a new telescope and I was taking pictures of the moon. I was taking time-lapse pictures and I was hooking up my dad's uh, Nikon to the end of it. I was just taking a bunch of pictures of the moon, but then my tripod, I hadn't quite figured it out yet. It dipped down, so it fell from the moon down to like aiming like rooftop level because I was uh, on the fifth floor. And um, it took a picture and it took a, a picture to 
and I didn't know what I had taken a picture of until I was going through all my moon pictures and then I looked back later and I was like, oh, this is weird. I've taken a picture of like a roof and I scroll across the picture, you know, because I'm zooming in. I'm like, what is that thing on the roof there? I scroll to the left, scroll to the left, go back down, go back down. I saw an alien. There is a white figure walking along the rooftop, all completely white, had a large head, and um, kind of freaked out. I had this like freak out moment. And uh, what I did was I saved that picture. That's right. Oh yeah, you saw it. So can you tell me what, does that look like an alien to you? Because I gave it to someone, I gave the picture to somebody and then they, they photo, they, uh, adjusted the bright brightness level and the contrast to see what if we could get some of the detail out on the on the image of that and basically we were able to see the face and the eyeballs of this alien of a creature so i uploaded it online to see if anyone else could tell me what it was it's creepy if you guys if you want to see it you can follow me on twitter at grambo uh just click on the media tab and then scroll down a little bit because it was a little while ago it's creepy. It's really scary. It's creeped me out. I, it's unexplainable. I was really hoping that it wasn't an alien. Because I hate aliens. But, uh, I don't know. It didn't kill me, so maybe I shouldn't hate them. This is creepy. Alright. Nightmare worthy? Yeah. You don't use Tweeter. I don't use Tweeter. Oh, I forgot to paint in the stripes. I feel like I'm gonna sneeze. I got this like... <coughs> Excuse me. Woo! Woo! No, I got my doodles on Instagram. I'm not putting photos of uh, aliens on my Instagram. Oh, thank you, definitely not. Yeah, well the creepy thing was, it's like it's got a head, it's got shoulders, it's got a neck, it's got eyeballs. Ugh. Like, what else could that be? And I was, like, looking at rooftops during the day with the telescope just to see, like, what the heck could this be? Unexplainable. I'm just gonna go back over and just finish these stripes here. On this guy. Can't have a zebra without stripes. It's just a horse. Just a fat, a fat mule. Donkey. It's just a fat donkey. You need to make movies for kids because oh, there's no more like that. There's no more like that. I love Super 8. I uh, like strange things. I could totally see myself directing uh, some shows like that. What if you're clumsy? If it's clumsy on my roof, I'm getting a shotgun. I'm gonna have a sawed off shotgun. I'm like, come on, alien. Come on. Come on, knock on my door. I'm waiting for you. I'm like, <laughs> opens the door. I'm like, <laughs> shoot that thing. Maybe he even comes in there with his big eyes. He's like, I'll come in peace. I'm like, <laughs> he's like, I bring you joy. I'm like, oh my God, he's bringing us joy. Kill it. <laughs> it was like the Simpsons episode where Mr. Burns is on medication and becomes like an alien. <laughs> I'll give you peace. Oh my god, he's giving us peace! Kill it! Trump, Trump banging Michelle Obama. Trump and... No! No, I won't. I don't want your pervertedness up in here. Can you draw Pikachu? We don't need that type of joy. We don't want your joy! Quick, kill it! Thing runs away. I'm just a crazy alien. I don't know what's going on. I'm just a crazy alien. I came down here to see what you guys were doing. Okay. Can you imagine if all aliens come down they sound like that? Okay. Hi, we come from another planet. Okay. We're just here to bring you some technology. And you're like, oh.
We're here to bring you technology. Advance your quick kill him. It would be insufferable. <laughs> it's Sideshow Bob. We have lo or imagine it's like the only way of communicating is talking really slowly, but it's like we have so much to tell you. It all started when I'd be like, kill it. <laughs> <laughs> this is the day of social media. We need things fast. Tell me in 144 characters or less. Or die. 144 characters or die. Kill it. There you go. The swift death. He's like, we have no patience for that. Quick, it's aliens. He's trying to tell us something. Seek too long. Kill it. All right. So is that person that wanted the uh, dolphins still there? Or are we going to doodle something else? Are we doodling something else? I don't think so. They gave up on the dolphin. All right. So does that mean I don't have to draw it? Do you guys have a different request instead? I'm gonna need some more wheat things. So good. Even stale wheat things are good. Perky characters? What's a perky character? Is there any children that want any cartoon characters? One day draw you. Uh, you can send me um, requests and stuff if you want. I might, if it's interesting, I might get to it. Crambo Doodles on Instagram or Twitter. Crambo. We gotta get some famous characters in here. What do you guys want? Famous characters. What's up, everybody? Welcome. Doodle dot dot. Hmm. Uh oh. BB eight. Well, I have drawn BB eight before, but that's gonna man, that's gonna be hard. Or Big Hero 6. Well, I can do BB 8. <whistles> BB 8 is basically just like two circles. Let's put them on the bottom. Move my crackers out of the way. Hmm? I am Groot. I am Groot. I am Groot. Woohoo! What's up, now? Twenty four eighty eight. Did you doodle the Groot? Yep. One of the first doodles on uh, Periscope. I doodle Groot. I doodle Groot. <laughs> I doodle Groot.
Maybe he's leaving like a trail. He's just like burning, burning rubber. I'm so excited about the next movie and soundtrack. I hope it's better than the last one. This is the music. I am Groot. There's a BB-8. He's ripping up a storm. He's like, what? He's like peeling out. He's like, oh. Uh, that was playing on the classical station on one of the first episodes. Is that the zebra from the zebra fruity gum packs, or am I tripping? <laughs> yeah. I know you're right. Jelly bellies. All right, let's finish. let's do a little. I'm so hungry. I think I'm gonna faint. Need another cracker. Will this be the first time a scoper has ever died of hunger on Periscope? What'd you do if you just like people show up and there's just like this like hand there? All I had was two pancakes for lunch. I thought that was gonna hold me over, but it didn't. Pancakes. Flapjacks. Not enough substance to survive. Waffles. Well, of course they are, but I didn't have waffles at my disposal. Rub it in, why don't you? Rub it in, rub it in. It's his tisk, tisking me. Crazy. Doing a little bit of like little details on BB-8. You guys should all learn how to draw BB-8. Once you get a hang of them, it's pretty fun. Just look to the robot. He's like, whoa. Is that your homework first? Yes. <clears throat> Just do the homework. Draw perfect circles. What do you guys all do for work? Or how old are you guys? You guys in school? Help us to be epic like you. Well, you gotta draw every day. Try drawing one thing once and then draw it again from memory really quickly and keep practicing. Uh, and then you end up realizing that a lot of things have so many similarities and you end up finding like the patterns. What's your zodiac? Uh, Scorpio. And then your hand starts to learn things. You don't even have to think about it. Sometimes your hand just does stuff. All right, so that's the beginning of BB-8. Where's my other pen? Unfortunately, no one can be told what the doodle is. They have to experience it for themselves. You need to choose. 
the blue pen or the red pen? If you choose the blue pen, you will continue to doodle and have unbelievable knowledge and power. If you choose the red pen, you will fall asleep waking up and none of this will ever exist. You'll go on living your life without any doodles, a hollow existence, unknowing of the actual truth. Well, I'll take the blue pen. Duh. Mr. Anderson. I am the chosen one. This is the chosen doodle. Are your hands still sore, hence the red? Yeah. When we hurt, we draw in red. When we happy in therapy, we draw in blue. Blue, blue, old. Blue, blue, old. Blue. Sorry, my friend. Hello there, little one. Don't be afraid. Come here. Come on. It's okay. some power converters. What? You there. Don't be afraid. Come over here. Having something special on when you're drawing? Have something special on? Que? Que? Lo comprende, senorita? Lo comprende? He loved it. He's making so much money. He took that deal, like when you're an actor, you have this uh, deal where you can get like a certain flat rate per film, which is like pretty high, or you could take a lower salary on the uh, pay grade, but you can take like residuals. So if the movie ends up doing really well, you can get a percentage of what the movie makes. So he was a, already a famous actor when he got that role in the first Star Wars. And so he decided, he said, well, this is a science fiction movie. It sounds kind of ridiculous, but it might make a lot of money. So he took a few million for the movie, or a little bit for the movie, and then he ended up getting a percentage of everything that Star Wars made in that movie. And that movie made billions, and so he made off with like a whole crap load of money with that deal that he did. And a lot of actors do that sometimes, hoping that the movie becomes like a big hit, like Avatar. I think when they made that movie Avatar, they thought that yeah, this movie with blue guys is going to actually do really well. But then you look at the director. Do you feel something special when you draw me? Because I, that's because I think that is something to do for you. Feel something special? Like the power? I feel the power of God come through my pen onto my paper. I'm the chosen one. Use the force. Use the force, Grambo. By the power of Grayskull, I am the power doodler. Power doodler. Power doodler. My name is Grambo. I come from Vancouver. With the power of the doodle. I save Vancouver from the evil forces of... Skeletor.
With my trusty sidekick, Old Blue, he transforms into Cringer. Mmm, these crackers are so good. All right, what's the next doodle? Maybe one more doodle, and then we're gonna stop. What's up, Addy? What's up, everybody? Thanks for joining. If you're just joining. <laughs> What's the next doodle? Mm -hmm. Hello, hello. Yeah, one more doodle and then I'm eating. Superman. That's right, it's superhero day today. Okay. That's his girlfriend. Well, we got Superman. Someone already asked for Superman. Or Robin. Mm -hmm. Can you draw a Mac from It's Always Sunny? Wait, these are so many requests. I thought you guys wanted Superman. It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia? Is it always sunny in Philadelphia? Or is that just a total lie? Phoenix. Try to do a parody of Superman. That was Superman. I watched Man of Steel earlier, so Cube of the Count of Monte Cristo. Count of Monte Cristo. Drop the pencil, Grambo. Don't do it. like that face or should I change it? It's okay. I'm gonna fix his... He's got the same hairstyle I have so I need to fix that. Gotta give him a cooler hair. Oh wait, where's my dog's butt? There's my dog's butt. It's got the worms. He's gotta drag his bum on the... A slight smirk. Oh, you want a slight smirk? Cause he is Superman after all. Mm 
I think I actually just drew the Hulk recently. Do the Hulk I'm gonna fix this S up. Do you first Superman or Batman? I like Superman. He's more admirable. Because he's a country guy. I like Superman because he's a country boy. He's not like a rich city boy. Like Batman. I'm Batman. Abs. Let's give him some delts. Deltoids. He's huge. <laughs> Who needs to build a wall when you've got Superman? <laughs> Pex. <laughs> Pack flex. <laughs> I'm Superman and I'm really huge. <laughs> so huge. <laughs> you know us. <laughs> I'm massive. Yeah. I think his new theme is the his new theme is perfect. I'm so huge. I can lift tall buildings. I can kill you, I can kill everyone, I'm massive, I'm unstoppable, mm, I can do whatever I want in the world. I can be a jerk, I'm Superman, I dare you to stop me, I'm Superman. When I fart, cities explode, I am Superman. Go. Deadpool. <laughs> When I pass gas, it's a nuclear explosion. <laughs> when I sneeze, people die. Being Superman is really tough. Superman is really hard. I'm huge. I'm huge. <laughs> Superman is huge. He's really big. I've made him ginormous. Mm -hmm. Superman, he's enormous. <laughs> I am too. You're huge too. Johnny Lemon. Lennon. Lennon Mamun. Can't even say that. Lemon Don't. Don't. I am Superman. I'm really huge. I can leap over tall buildings and stop locomotives. I dare you to do the same. Let's arm wrestle. I'm huge. I'm huge. You're a big guy, 300 pounds. Is that pure muscle? 300 pounds of pure muscle. Mm -hmm. I need to go to take shows to go to work and I'm ready to go to the studios. Oh, thanks. Thanks, Brown Shoe. Pure muscle. I can bench. Sometimes I bench benches just for fun. 
do do pounds you can bench 1000 pounds I can stop a train with my pinky finger <whistles> ah the jig is up I've been found being antisocial ah uh, I figure I've made a mistake screwed up the S Screw up the S. My bad. Oh well, what can you do? Screwed up the S. Pretty sure I screwed it up. It looks kind of weird to me. Looks a little weird to me. Yeah, it's too big on that side. Don't you know how to draw a diamond, Grambo? Don't you know how to draw a diamond? Jeez. <laughs> What's up, everybody? Thanks for joining. We're almost done our dual session today. It's a quick one. Oh, it's weird getting on the edge of the paper. Getting on the edge of the paper. some pecs, some big abs. Mm. Very awesome. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Lisa Ann 83. I appreciate it. I appreciate everything. <laughs> person thank you I tried I tried <laughs> it was horrible I failed on your name oh look at that Superman Superman is here in the flesh that's me he's like there it's me Superman hola what's up everybody Superman never made in her hell Saving the world from solemn ground deal. Sometimes Lisa as your favorite. Yeah. Sometimes I despair. The world will never see another man. Like him. I am Groot. I am Groot. I am Groot. I am Groot. Your typo. I am Groot. I have a lisp today, everybody. Uh, my name is Groot. Uh, welcome to Groot Anonymous. People that can only say Groot. Please tell us your name and what you're doing here. Uh, I am Groot. I am Groot. Next. I am Groot. I am Groot. Uh, and then the host is like, this is going to be a long day. No, yeah. No, yeah. Alright, I'm just going to do a little quick shading. Although I probably could have just shaded with my pan. Which I'm going to do. I'm going to do. Mm This is going to end pretty soon. I am good. 
Alright, I'm gonna just quickly bring out my brush. This is my Faber Castell. Faber Castell Pit Artist Pen. Perfect for shading and doing crazy things like this. Excuse me, I'd like to ask you a few questions. Oh, oh I used the wrong color. This is going to be a very dramatic drawing today. Let's make this one really dramatic. Really dramatic with the shading. Superman, do, 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 do. Superman is huge. He's so strong, he can lift anything. Superman. All right, we got time for one last doodle this week. Ah, oh. great, thank you. Hi, you have a good week? Yes, thank you. How about you? Got my eraser ready. I got one last room for... Oh, thank you. We got some room for one last doodle. You guys want Deadpool? Deadpool as the last superhero? You can fit him right in here. I can show you guys how to draw Deadpool. You want to draw Deadpool with me? Yeah? We're gonna draw Deadpool together. You drew that Superman quick, I left two minutes ago. Uh, draw Darth Vader as fast as you can. Darth Water? Darth Water? Darth Water? I'm gonna show you, we're gonna do, okay, so let's see, let's put him right here. So let's see, first you draw like your head shape, like this. Let's get the proportions right. There's your head shape. Let's give him a little hat, like this. A little toque. And his neck, like this. And then we're gonna give him like some, his uniform, like that. Darth water. What are you drinking there? It's the new water. Is that Evian? No, it's Darth water. Darth water? You drink it and you get a cool voice like this. Well, that's cool. Let me try some of that. I am your father. Sweet. Hey, what's up? What's up? So that's where I'm going to put his outfit like that and then I'm gonna put his little frowny face and maybe like another part like this like that my name is Kayla my name is Grambo Graham how are you doing how are you doing And then I'm gonna, oh, I think I'm gonna change the shape of this guy's head now that I've got his eyes in here. I'm gonna change it a little bit. Oh, he's kind of screwed up. I'm gonna do it that way first. All right, so, make his chin like this. Let's make his head a little bit bigger, like that. Yeah, I haven't watched one of these in forever and I forgot how much I love them. Thank you. You Spanish? No. I am sorry, senorita. I am a lot of Spanish.
How come Deadpool doesn't have a theme song? He's getting ripped off. He's like, yeah, how come I don't have a theme song? He's like, I should have a theme song. I know what my theme song's gonna be. He presses play and it's like, baby, don't hurt me no more. Boom, 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 Make him a little more evil. Evil and angry. Like that. Yeah. There we go. Deadpool was like, steal my sunshine. Hey, why not for me if you steal my sunshine? Why will not and come on for me if you steal my sunshine? Does that look like Deadpool? I think I make that more look more like Deadpool. It's kind of like Scorpion. Scorpion, get over here for all this victory. For all this victory. Sub zero. Sub zero. Yeah. I am the chosen one. I. He's like, I am the chosen one. Mortal Kombat! Dun, dun, dun. Victory. Fight. It's a nice sunny day. It's a nice sunny day. And let's get this eye red. Get the eye red, Grambo. What's up, everybody? Don't forget, you guys can follow me on Instagram, see how the doodles turn out. These scopes last 24 hours, so you can watch free plays for 24 hours only. Follow me on Instagram, Grambo Doodles, and on Twitter, Grambo. G R R G R R A M B O. Grambo. Draw an authentic African mask. Oh, authentic. Authentic. Hmm, I'd have to look that up. That is a word I have not heard. It is a word that I have not heard before. With great doodles come great responsibility. I'm gonna put this as a shoulder strap. Draw Goku. I don't draw Goku. Goku has been retired. Traditional. That's a traditional mask. Okay. Well, actually, this is going to be the last doodle for the doodle session. And then I'm going to go make myself some dinner. So I'm just going to quickly outline this. Like that. Maybe I'll go back in here. 
I'm gonna like fancy eyes here. What's up everybody? Thanks for watching. So thanks everybody for watching another doodle session. I am your host, Grambo. Thanks for all the fun requests. Make sure you guys uh, follow me to see how all of these finish up. On the social medias. On the social medias. All right, do my little signature here. I don't see any unicorns, racist. Huh? Doesn't make any sense. All right, so uh, you can follow me. Oh, you're welcome. Um, oh, you're welcome. Merci. Merci pour ta joie de vivre. Ah. My pleasure. All right, so we'll just do a little signature to end off the doodle scope. There we go. So thanks everyone for watching. Again, I am your host, Grambo. Ah, thank you. Make sure you guys can follow me on Twitter, G-R-R-A-M-B-O. If you guys want to uh, follow me on Instagram, you can see how other doodles turned out. Grambo Doodles, G-R-R-A-M-B-O Doodles. And uh, don't forget, the replays are available for 24 hours, and then all these scopes will start to disappear. All right, see you guys later. Thanks. Bye-bye.